I left my $30,000 business to go all in selling low ticket digital products. And to be honest, the decision came from pure burnout because I was tired of working 10 to 12 hours a day fulfilling four clients, no weekends, no time spent with my family or friends. Hi everyone, let's create this amazing reel which has a very good design in CapCut. If you also want to learn how to edit this viral reel in After Effects, I have also made a video for it. Check out the description and you will learn how to make this reel from scratch. So let's begin on how to make with CapCut. So as you can see, this will be our first animation. So in the first animation, as you can see here, there are many objects here. Okay, it's a minimalistic design. Okay. There's number counting here and then this card is swiping. Okay, so we'll just, you know, do a different type of, you know, editing over here. Just enhance this a bit. So when he's swiping the card, nothing is happening. It's just normal. But what we will do is when he swipes the card, a paper will come out from here. Okay, this will not be stationary. A paper will come out. So let's do that. So let me just keep this aside over here. First, I'll bring my image. Okay. And bring in a default text layer put it below this image and then hit on windows press dot key to open this symbols and then select the square now i'm in the square bigger okay yeah now what i'll do is make it this color so i'll just select this and then just select the color picker tool and select this color now you can see we have got that now i'll bring in my card rotate it a bit put it over here bring my barcode and then you know just put it like this okay then i'll bring my grid okay so all these images which i am using over here i have got it from google images and free pick so you know if you want these images you can just check out the description i provided everything but if you want to do it yourself just head on to google images and search for you no know, barcode png or credit card png or you know this machine png so you will get you know these type of images some of the images i have got from free pick okay they provide premium you know images but some of them are paid so make sure to choose the three ones now i'll just put the grid behind this now what i'm going to do is do the card swiping animation first so i'll just hit this to make it you know flip okay make it bigger so this will come and then swipe okay so we'll just keep it out of frame here go to the starting and hit on transform keyframe go ahead and then just put it over here like this so we get this animation now hit alt plus k and then i'll just put in this out by hitting cubic out and then just go ahead again click transform keyframe and again go ahead and this time drag this down and out of the way okay now i'll hit alt plus k again and then hit cubic out It all plus K again. Okay, so we have got that card swiping animation, but now we want to do that paper animation which will come out okay from here. So what we are going to do is first select this, okay? Add on to mask, add mask, split. Okay, make sure you turn it to minus 180 or not 180, just turn it like this. Okay, I'll zoom it in so you can see properly. Okay, make sure that turn it from here okay this white part and then just copy this and then delete the mask okay so this is the masked and this is unmasked now you know exchange the placement okay so this one is a masked layer and this is the non-masked layer now i'll bring my bill png okay and put it over here now you can see that it is going behind this so just make this smaller like this okay i'll zoom it again so you can see it properly and then make sure to make it you know as per the size of this okay yeah so now you can see you have got that what i'll be doing is just keep it over here okay like this and then 
when the card is swiped over here i'll just hit on this transform keyframe go ahead and then drag this out like this okay hit alt plus k and then select cubic out okay so this will be the animation now to make it more realistic what we are going to do is simply i just you know select this okay and then copy this okay now I'll select the below layer and just drag this out head on to adjust curves and drag this down okay to make it black so i drag down all the curves okay put over here i'll head on to effects and search for blur bring this okay and put it over here now I increase this okay and then what i can do is simply head on to basic okay video and then decrease the plan okay according to your need now i'll just do the same thing with our hand so i just copy this which is hazy so i'll just bring this to on top of the okay and adjust the blur and this horizontal and vertical okay now let's see what else is there in the starting animation yeah the text okay digital product so i just bring in my default text now i'll put this over here and you know simply I'll just select these two and on to animation and select fade in okay now to give it movement in this frame what I'll be going to do is a simple zoom out animation so I'll just select everything okay and then hit alt plus c to make it a compound clip okay and then head on to video transform keyframe go ahead over here somewhere and again hit on transform keyframe go to the first keyframe and zoom this in okay hit alt plus k and then keyback out okay and as you can see there is a number counting effect here too so i just add that in the description how to make number counting effect in CapCut so learn it from there how to make the number counting effect and then you can apply it here okay so this takes care of our first part of the animation so the second part is very easy okay first of all just you know have the same background so just copy paste the background over here okay now i'll just bring in a default text layer and then in those press dot key this then select this okay and make this big okay, somewhat like this now we'll choose the color i'll select this okay and go over here and then select this color okay as simple as that now i'll bring my this image put it inside okay This second animation is actually easier than the first one. So again and bring in another text right here 10 space 12. Okay. Then change the font. Put it behind over here. Then copy this and just curves, drag this down. Now just copy this again and rotate it, put it over here. Again, bring blur on top of it. 
okay and just go inside this bring copy our barcode and then paste it okay over here let's copy our hazy part and again paste it over here okay and as you can see in the second frame there are these lines okay so to do that it's very simple just i'll head on to you know google images search for baby lines eng okay and you know we cannot go for black so you know like this these type of images just save image click and then what i can do is create another and go to remove background okay this site i'll upload my image over here and then i'll just head on to my cap cut downloads and then bring it over here and just put it below this okay my wavy lights i can just mask out the lines which i don't want so for for us i don't want you know this line so i'll just put it like this okay so this is something like that and to animate it just simply you know i'll just make this a compound clip first just head on to mask add mask split okay go here transform keyframe go ahead and bring it over here hit all plus k and then keep it out okay so you get this animation and similarly you can do this so this is how you are able to do both these animations hope you like this video and don't forget to like and subscribe my channel and see you in the next video